I have your signed agreement form here, Mr. Jones. Which waivers any right on your part to take any further action should you not get what you want here today. That being said, customer service is something we take extremely seriously. So, are we ready? Mr. Jones. James. Are we ready? Who? Who is he? Why? Why? I don't know, this just seems a bit... Barbaric? Yes. That's because it is. Just think about what you're doing, and more importantly, why you're here. I don't think I can go through with this. And again, I'd like to remind you of our no-refunds policy at this time. How is this legal? It's not. But then again, neither was what happened to you and yours. Right? There has to be another way. Well, go find one then and stop wasting my time. Can you at least tell me his name? It's John. Okay. Wake him up. Can you hear my voice? <coughs> Do you remember me? Uh, what now? Ask away. Do I? Just ask. Firstly, I just want to say how grateful I no. am. No. What? Why? Ask what you came here to ask or say what you came here to say. <coughs> I don't know where to start. Perhaps their names might be a good starting point. Emily Jones? <sighs> Philip Jones and... And... Steph Jones. Ask away. Do you ever think about me? You have to get closer, Mr. Jones. Thank you. All good? Did he tell you everything you needed to know? Yes. I believe he did. Well, all right then. Thank you so much. It's our pleasure, and please come back any time. You must be Molly. That's right. You've read our brochure? Yeah. Did it explain everything? It did, but... But what? I'm just not sure how, you know... Please. Basically, we bring about and then prolong end of life until such time as the subject acts as a beacon or conduit, if you like, to the other side. Yeah, it says that in your brochure, almost word for word. What does it mean, though? Can I speak frankly? Please. We basically beat and talk to someone, inflict as much pain as we can right up until the point of death. And then, at that point when they're about to tip over, we stop and leave them somewhere between this life and the next, where they have a direct line to anyone that's passed. Your loved ones await. And it works. It actually works. Our success rate speaks for itself. It just sounds so... Barbaric. Reprehensible. Who are you to inflict so much pain on a person? And who are these poor people who... These poor people are all volunteers. They are? Absolutely. Why? I hear it gives them a tremendous sense of power, not to mention peace of mind. I don't know what to say. Any questions you have can be left to your deceased father. Let's not keep him waiting. Okay. 